What? We're live. Uh, post. Now I gotta pin it. I gotta pin it. There's always a little bit of a thing trying to pin this shit. Uh, let's pin this shit. Let's pin this shit. Pin. Boom. Done. All right. Unboxing 12. Get the cameras ready. Hello to Instagram. Hello to YouTube. Uh, I should have put a Band-Aid on first. The big question for Unboxing 12 is did I go Laffy Taffy or did I go Adderall? Well, if you've been paying attention, I did Adderall. Laffy Taffy was a little bit much for me. I was so fucked up last time. I didn't remember what I opened in hour one and hour three. And it affected me. I was, I was fucking in a daze yesterday. I was still in a little bit of a daze today. That's what the Laffy Taffy will do to you. So I want Adderall to keep that energy, keep that focus. Uh, so welcome. I'd love to hit 70,000 combined. Now, we used to do this only Instagram. Then people are like, we can't stream Instagram on our TVs. We want to watch this as a show. It's quarantine. We can't leave the house. This, that, the other thing. I'm putting on gloves. So we do it on both. So right now... YouTube's always slower to start, I think, because I don't have, like, the notification like I have on Instagram. So, Instagram, we're at, what, 15,000, uh, 2,400 on YouTube. We'll keep those things going, and hopefully I keep the energy. We probably have three hours, maybe a little less, of unboxing. So, let's get the uh, theatrics out of the way here, this glove, doctor glove. Pull your guts out with it. Um, first of all, a little extra caffeine, death wish. Thanks for the sponsorship. They own the coffee vertical in this. What do I say? It's not Coke. It's Death Wish. Not Coca-Cola, the white stuff. I... Anyways. Use the promo code Dave. DeathWishCoffee.com. That's good. That's iced coffee. 15% off. It's not Coke. It's Death Wish. Let's get into unboxing. We got two boxers. Little machete. Three box cutters. This one's a motherfucker. This one will cut your fucking face off. Um, three of those and a knife. A little gap in the table. Maybe we bring those together. All right. You guys ready? 16, 4. We're up to 20. I guess we just get going. Tell your friends. Tell your enemies. Tell everybody. I want to hit 70. Is that just an impossible thing? I don't know. How's my hair look today? It's a little fluffy. No product in it today. No product. Let's start unboxing. No days, ex exotic fish shop? See, now I caught this right at the top. Clearly the guys who helped me stack this did it, but this says exotic, uh, exotic fish shop on it. We don't want animal. We're starting with an animal. We're lucky I caught that, to be totally fucking honest. It almost seemed like it'll be set up. But at least now I won't scare the bejesus out of me. Just goldfish? This just looks like goldfish. This doesn't look like anything exotic about this, except maybe these are Randolph's size? Those look like they could live with Randolph. Are those goldfish? Stop sending fish! Stop sending fish! Also, somebody sent me a DM and said, this got lost. I'm a lefty. Lefty keep, righty trash. That's how we're going to do it. Another Stella painting. Thank you very much. I love this dog. Uh, we'll put that in the keep. Those goldfish actually look like they were goldfish. I, does it say what it is? What is this? I don't know. What it is. Maybe they intentionally made to be brothers with Randolph. Oh, we're going, we're going here. What do we got, 18, getting up to 18? Speaking of that, from the Unboxing 11, remember this painting? I told you, and I talked to the guy, Zach Riddle, who is fucking awesome, awesome. Uh, we have limited edition merch on sale. We have, uh, I think, two hats and t-shirts with this design on it. They're kind of fire, to be totally honest. They will only be on sale till the next unboxing. That's how we do this. 
You gotta buy it when it's hot. Once the next, once unboxing thirteen happens, that shit's gone. Go to our store. We have like nice dad hats, bro hats, and t-shirts. Girls even crop tops. Let's unbox. Now that that's out of the way. It's amazing the difference between doing drugs and not doing drugs can make you. Like I feel good right now. See, now I'm a little nervous. Whenever I'm seeing this, I'm thinking fish. New England Patriots. So the New England Patriots team known. I, I looked because I didn't want to get fished. Uh, let's just take this thing up. Also, people, oh, you're, you're, you're again, people still tell me my delivery man must hate me. We're tipping the delivery man. They're doing their job. What do you want me to do? People are dying for work. We're giving them work. We're giving them work. Titleist. Little Titleist hat. What is it? Just a hat? Oh, is there a note? Is there anything in this? Just Dave, thank you. Okay. Titleist hat. It's not just underwear. It's fun to wear. Web underwear. You marketing companies, you know how it is. You gotta, you gotta give me a note. Notes make all the difference. It's homemade love. Just marketing companies just sending blank shit, automatic trash, automatic shit on. Pepperoni pizza boxers, one bite. Okay, these don't look like, are they in there? Oh yeah, I'm a cheese guy. I don't know what, it, what a girl's thinking if they open it and see pepperoni boxers. Those do gimmicky, like, I'm not trying to be, you know, Get a laugh if we get to the point of the night where a girl takes your pants off and it's like, oh, cute, you're the pizza guy, you have pepperoni. No. No, I'll hit him with the, uh, my brain is like fried, but I'll hit him with the, what boxers do I have? I have one brand of boxers and one, huh? you know what? Dolce & Gabbana. There it is. I, I had to like do an end around on my brain. Hey, Dave, you only wear one pair of boxers. You're wearing boxers right now. What are you wearing? Do. Is this Randolph? Yeah, it is. That's just Randolph right there being a fucking king. That's just Randolph being a fucking king. That may be on sale in the next uh, unboxing. By the way, Randolph's doing great for those asses. He's almost been eaten twice, but his comeback dog corn holders already had him. Now we're going. So much more pep, so much more energy. It was... Getting a little nervous by this packing. By the way, mixed. I'm like, should I do Laffy Taffy tonight or Adderall? Half the people said, do the Laffy Taffy. We're going to do it with you. We're going to get super high. Other half were like, nope, stick with the Adderall. Some glasses, I guess. Not I guess, I know. You going to put in a note? Brick by brick. I began handcrafting these never before seen mind bedding leather sunglass straps almost 10 years. Here's, uh, so the, our first pair of sunglasses with a leather cord. So they're about the cord life, I guess. Not so much the glasses. They're more about the cord, like croquis. Oh, these don't look like good on me at all. I look like some evil genius or something, right? And I don't mean evil genius. I just mean like, I guess not good. Like if I saw me walking down the street, I'd be like, I want no part of that. Thing. Not in a good way. Also tough to see. Sneaky. Oh. Well, little Jeff Bagwell action in the house. Um, notorious, great baseball player, Hall of Famer. He knew how to fuck, too. That's what everyone said. Had a very unique fuck style. Oh. I am purpled out. These fucking guys who sent me this shirt, the glasses may work with the shirt. I may now look like I'm in Boogie Nights a little bit. So these guys, this Vikings guy, sent me the shirt. When the stream cut out and my battery died and I had every intention of wearing it and I am wearing it But then I kind of got pissed at these guys because they kept tweeting me. Hey, wear a shirt. The thing got cut out We got screwed. I'm still wearing it, but you're pushing it. Nobody's getting screwed I didn't ask you to send anything. It is a cool shirt though. Randy Moss moon game like whoop. And I'm wearing purple kind of works Did you guys see my tweet today? Somebody's making a froze in honor of my uh, dick print they are. It's, it's like a frosé eggplant dick print. The Poor House. Is this Boston? Old school? The Poor House? Uh, Central Taco and Tequila. What? The whole mission places. PJ's Fit Fan? Nope. Nope me. 
Brez, we're a regional restaurant group out of New Jersey, Pennsylvania. Big fans, videos kept us throughout. Uh, P.S. Wheel of Hands restaurant group. Thank you, Wheel of Hands. Hopefully you guys make it through this. Hopefully everybody makes this shit through this. Feels so much better than I did the other day. I mean, I felt good when I was laffy taffy out, but by the end of it, I was dragging ass. Sweatpants, just straight sweatpants. And uh, we're looking at a no-note situation. Come on, come on, tent tree, be better. No time for that. What am I doing? I can't see shit. I'm like, oh, it's dark in here. I can't fucking see what I'm doing. Yeah, no shit, Dave. I'm wearing sunglasses. That's how that works. I wear my sunglasses and set. Oh, what? Yeah, what? Okay, yeah, this is, I couldn't tell what those side flippers were. Little Randolph action. Very cute. Mark Duper, all-time quote, by the way, about wearing sunglasses inside. Wore sunglasses during a night game against the Chicago Bears. Hey, say Mark Duper, wide receiver, Dolphins. Why are you wearing sunglasses? Pizza rope? Pizza rope. Sun never sets on the cool. What a line. But can't be boxing and doing it when I can't see. Fly Breeze series? What the fuck is this? A globe? A flag? Is there a note or just Amazon? What? I don't get it. What is this thing? What is this little cooler of death? Shipping manager. Anytime now I see something like this, I get a little bit fucking nervous that something bad is about to happen. Can you guys see the packages? Should I go down a little bit? This makes me think... Something bad. What now I'm discard. No animals. It's a mug. It's a mug with me and Stella. Oh, it's a Stella Bean mug. It's a Stella Bean mug. Thank you. I hope Stella's in doggy heaven right now, just like strutting that ass, going up to the other dogs, like, hey, do you have a million people painting like pictures of you right now? Because I do. Like, do your owners even like you? What is this? Just paper towels? Megan Kramer. Hey, Prez, someone like you shouldn't be wiping their hands with toilet paper, so here's a paper towel roll. Sorry it's not bounty. I ran out. Much love, Megan Kramer from Florida State. All right, that's love. That's just fucking love. And you know what else is going to be a little bit tough for me to get back to? Normal society not wearing fucking floral shirts with chest hair bumping and a goldfish necklace. I look like somebody who will sell you drugs and then like just fuck in the middle of a club. And I don't hate it. And will probably be like annoying and you don't really want to be friends with. Glitter bomb? No thanks. No. I mean, it's definitely a glitter bomb. I guess this isn't my house anymore. But we'll see how many. I haven't had a glitter bomb in a while. Unbox me. What? Is that? It literally says, unbox me on it. Is that a thing? What does that mean? Unbox me? Okay. I will. How do you unbox you, though? Surprises. What? What is this little guy? Am I walking into a trap? This is the bitch. Unbox me, what does that mean? How do you unbox you? Are you unboxed? What do you mean unbox you? I'm confused. I'm so confused. How do you unbox something that refuses to be unboxed and is like a little globe? Oh wait, here we go, there's an arrow. There's an arrow. This is, this is a waste of time, I think. But if you say unbox me in an unboxing and I start down this path, I kind of have to do it. But this is a fucking gigantic pain in the ass. Come on. This is candy, what the fuck? It's a kid's toy, clearly. Uh, 
I, I haven't gotten my ass kicked by a gift like this in quite a while. We're still just taking off fucking paper here. This may be the most anti like, the chocolate. Holy, this is something you give your dog when you put a treat in the middle and it occupies them all day long. That's what's happening right here. I'm getting demolished. All right, I'm blocking. Piece of shit. It still has shit on it. You glow, girl? Laugh out loud, surprise. It's a fucking cop. It's a coffee mug. It's like a large fucking coffee mug. That That's it. I did all that shit for that. Who sent that? I want that person to fucking execute. Whoever sent that, fuck you. I hope you die. We got here a book. The, Gi the Giving Pig, a parody by Chevy Sucker Buck. Glass this side up. That was another one that was just. I mean, I guess it's hard to send new gifts that are interesting at this point because we've done. Well, this is the twelfth unboxing, but come on, Mr. Port, my family sauce business. Okay, we don't like sauces. What kind of sauce is it? I'll give you a little shout. We're in the fucking. You know why I'm gonna do this? Because it's for small business. Now hurry up. He wrote a thing. It's fucking quarantine. People need fucking money. I'm doing it for small business. They wrap this up. Is this tomato sauce? Come on, you piece of shit. Hardy Marinara. The Vesiglis. Small business. You're welcome. You don't have to give me ten of them, though. This looks like a book. Sharing designs. Oh, some sort of clap. Maybe best fish dad. What do we got? Viva. All right. There we go. All right, we cruising. I almost just lost the thing. I have a hip flexor. I haven't complained about that yet, but I do. Artisan Owl. Box in a box always gets me. Mug? I like mugs. I'm going to get tired of mugs if they're good. Fucker in charge of you fucking fuck. Bumbling and stumbling, bumbling all over the place here. How are we doing on viewers? 20,000, 34,000. I think I don't think we're ever gonna ever have the 70 night. I don't know how to get a 70. Have to have that stripper Maddie come back or something. Prez, your friend Rome ordered one of these when he found out I was an out of work bartender, but I wanted to send you a custom one as thanks for keeping us entertained. Okay. The heck? I don't know what it is. Oh, you, thank you, Brie, and note candles. So they're candles, okay? Candles, thank you. Kind of boy, Rome, fragile. This thing says fragile. Liquidy capital, what does that mean? Does that mean it's gonna be like some sort of uh, day to day trading situation? I feel like I'm really flying right now. Mug, please fix, thanks. Fuck is that trash? So far, not the greatest crop of gifts. What is this guy? Join us in the pleasure revolution. Looks like a little uh, sex toy. Keep the sex toy. A Zumio to Dave Davy Page. There's two Zumios. Um, swirl motion pressure tunt simulation vent designed by uh, women. Whisper quiet, waterproof. A little, little something for the lady. All right. Dave Portnoy with a little Canadian flag on this one. Sell the border. Barstool Baskins loves Jacks. Carol Baskin loves Jacks. Are we all on board? Carol Baskins murdered her husband. Is that just the consensus? Sweatshirt. What do we got? Duve, Duve Warden Holyage LLC. And some hat. It is a Canada company. Some Canadian 40 Creek Barrel. Nice little gift. That's not a bad gift. Not a great gift. 
of powder cookies. You know. But today, not maybe the best one we got. I went too fast there. I'll eventually stab myself at that rate. Cover the spread. Amen to that. Blade. I went to high school. All right, hey Dave. Uh, same time as high school. Went to high school. Same time around that pirate Simon Muskie intern Dana. I went to start Glade goggles after college. I figure as an average skier such as yourself, I'm not an average skier. Could use it. Best wishes. All right. Let's see how I look in fucking some ski goggles. A little shush action here. Have you ever seen dudes like wear these out? I like a style. These are kind of badass. I kind of feel like an alien right now. And also, they're not like dark. Like this just turned it yellow, but it's not dark. Like the sunglasses made dark. These may be unboxing glasses. We'll see how it goes. Like I can see just fine. I'm just in a parallel universe right now. What is this? Uh, core, relax, enjoy, refresh. Hemp, I think. Love bundle. All right, let's see what you got in a love bundle. Buddy Love, Bud Love. Uh, where's this in here? Is this? Buddy Love, bunch of t-shirts. No fucking, that shirt actually looks kind of cool, but zero personalization. Who's Buddy Love? Like, uh, who's that old guy uh, in the wrestling? Who did it all pink? Mr. Love, Buddy Love. Thanks for keeping us saying with these pizza reviews unboxing. Look forward. I saw you big league chew immediately. Thought these would go great. Oh, those are fucking fire. Big league chew. That's the number one gift right now. Some New Balance big league chew fucking slippers. Fuck right. Those are fucking fire. I'd wear the fuck out of those at a pool party in Vegas. Oh, this is my face. I see my face. This is when St. Louis Blues, when I got attacked. I got fucking attacked in St. Louis. And, yeah, you're lucky I don't have my fucking samurai sword. Nah, I don't really fucking... This one. No. Yeah, uh, all right. Let's find a good fucking sword. Uh, yeah, that's... You sent me a little fake Stanley Cup. Well, starting to get a little mess early. We'll fucking shout out Spider. This is how he broke his fucking hand. Let's see if we can do this. That fucking took care of that fucking piece of shit fuck thing. Don't cut yourself, Dave. Out of boy. People that don't take the samurai swords here, you're wrong. What's this? Man's sexy squirting banana, huh? Man's sexy squirting banana, huh? Man's sexy squirting banana, what? What does that mean? Just a... Oh, see? Dick in a banana. Took me a little while. This would be the worst. Not that I'm a concierge of dildos. That's good. that's gonna be a joke. Like, if you are dating a girl who would go anywhere near that thing, you should probably get rid of that girl. That's just my thing. My neck. I'm like looking at everything from different proportions right now with these glasses on. So we're gonna take care of them. I did like how I look. Though. There's also that sacrifice of being like the cool guy who's just unboxing versus not being a really acting mate. I feel like I have a weird. I mean, whoever sent that executed just like three pairs of glasses, no words on who they are. Fuck you. Everyone's dumber for having to sit through that one. Upside down. Good flip, veteran move from an unboxer. Westbrook Sports Classics look like stadiums. Prez, hope you've been doing well. Big fan. I've been watching your live streams. I want to give you something of sentimental value. 
I'm guessing it's Fenway Park. This thing's heavy. Is it Fenway? It's gotta be. Yeah, that's gonna be the monster. Pretty cool, heavy little gift. Yeah, Boston Red Sox, there it is, on the other side. Very cool gift, thank you. Get through all these little guys. I can handle this one, what do we have? We're at 25 minutes in, I got a good pace going. Gifts have been a little weak, I'd say, but that last one was cool. The slides were cool. What do we got here, some purple socks? Just purple, just purple everywhere. Uh, purple. Purple? Purple. Is that because I'm wearing purple? Oh! Oh, that was bad. That's dick. Smelled fucking horrible. Just a fucking thick thing to send. Davy Day Trader. King, who's. What a dick. What a dick. Who, what, what a dick was this? The Godfather? He sent a fish's head? What a fucking dick. And let me tell you something. The fucking smell hit me way before the fucking, like, I was like, poof. And then I looked, and it's just a dead fucking hit fish's head. Piece of shit. Piece of shit. What is this? Patriots. Go Patriots. Assholes. Moist. Slightly moderate or wet. L lick, laugh, and love. Six and nine poems about the silent sights, sounds, tastes, smells, and feelings of sex. All right, let's read a quick poem. How do you, where does the poem start? Uh, what's a good poem here? I don't really, dinner for, French fry kiss. Kissing is a critical part of foreplay, but everything went wrong when I got a taste of what they ate yesterday. That's the poem. The smells, Taco Bell, Febreze, Socks, Double Ply, Jack Daniels, Bakery, Spring Showers, Perfume, Beeswax, Middle Class, Tiny Hand. I don't get it. I don't get those poems, not even a little bit. I, I try to. I'm like on the lookout now for just getting punked with like dead fish heads. It was only a matter of time for something like that happened. Because everyone's assholes. We're trying to bring back small business and people send dead fish heads. This is an oak box on a box on a box. How do you get fucking dead fish heads? What was that all about? Four place print. One bite. Happy Passover. Stay safe. Love the Jews. All right. I can live with that. Are we still in Passover? I don't think so. El Prez. Custom declarations. What does that mean? What does that mean? Custom declarations. International priority. Who sent me something international? Nervous. Got just steely nerves right now. Instant fines for swearing. Pay a, a swear jar? That's what this guy internationally sent me? Kid show. It is a kid show. But you know what? Is it a kid show when I'm getting dead fish heads in the mail? I don't know that it is then. Nice. It just says nice on this. Unboxed with some drawings on it. Hat of some sort. Show me that butthole. Okay, uh, kids show, show me that butthole. First, you know, this is not really a hat worthy of being worn. You know what, kids show, we're not gonna do the butt. We don't wanna get a kid. Mug, what is going on here from Tony Sumo? I got the yips. I got the fucking yips from a fucking potato. I got a fu fuck the fucking potato. Get the yips now because of that fish head. Everything I'm feeling, I'm like, what's in here? Is it gonna fucking bite me? Snow Bio Labs, what'd you send me? Snow Bio Labs in this nice packaging. Ooh, what is this? Feels like get... I got the yips. I got the fucking yips. You would too if you opened up that. 
Picture of fucking Gronk. I don't know what, what that is all about. Looks like he's at a fucking sex party or something. Prez, you can't snort this snow, but you'll have the purest smile in the room. Pat's Nation. So teeth whitening, I assume? I don't do coke, people. Maybe ten times in my life. Fuck that person who gave me the yips. You know, now it's slowing down because I'm afraid of everything. Yeah, those are fucking... I, there's like huge creatures in here. Do we have tape? Does this say something on the outside? Oh, it says insects. There's huge fucking insects in here. I don't want no fucking part of that. I open it like a fucking buffoon. Can someone fucking tell me when it says insects on the outside, please? Holy fuck, those are like fucking monsters. This is how this thing ends. I gotta find some fucking tape. I open that thing, they're crawling around, they're probably fucking killer. This gotta be fucking, all right. I know, hold on. Everyone just hold the fuck on. Those things, what were those? Those definitely could kill you. They were fucking this big each. And I saw him looking at me with those fucking beady eyes. What are them? Were people screaming on there like, insect, insect, insect. Fuck you. Actually, here's fucking some tape. I think I can smell them because it's feeding time. How do I do this without... I got the fucking tape on me now. Do you fucking pieces of shit out there would ruin a good thing by sending me dead fish heads and fucking insects. Trying to do good for the community here and this is what we're getting. We're getting fucking insect to death. These, I don't know what these were. Cockroaches? I don't know what the... You shouldn't be able, whoever... Only a maniac sends fucking insects in the mail. I almost want to, like, who, why, you should never be allowed to send animals, insects, anything. This tape is killing me. These guys are trying to get out and trying to kill me. Ah. My hand caught in there. I think it's safe to say I won that round. Now I'm going to have to go slow. If that's the game we're going to be playing tonight, let's fucking send ridiculous shit in the mail that tries to eat Dave, fucking fuck Dave up. Then I'm going to have to go slow. So fuck you. 
I gotta look where everything's sent now before I open it. It's not the nature of this game. You give people nice things and they can't handle it. What is this? My name is Dave and I have diarrhea. Things have taken a turn for darkness. We're in darkness. This thing's all buckled up. Well, who are you from? Brian Sora, Worcester. Do I see anything suspicious on you? Those bugs were fucking this big. Like, I see black now, and I jump. It's a fucking baseball hat, and I, I got the yips. I'm going to have the yips all fucking night. I'm going to be a nightmare about this shit. Diego Gas. Let's just get back to basics here. Like, put on fucking hats, change shirts, get paintings of Stella, not fucking dead fish heads and animals. Hats too short. Fucking hey, man. Insects. What the fuck were those? Cockroaches or something. That's a little bit big, but whatever. We're moving too. See, I get a look. Sticky dickers. Dave, smells good. What's in here? It smells really fucking good. Honolulu, Hawaii. Please enjoy plentiful dick jokes on us. What? Welcome to the corn peen. Stay safe. Draw more dicks. Stay healthy. Dicks. Everything about this thing is dicks, dicks, dicks. So let's be careful. Are you just getting dicked? Like a fucking... Just dick. It's just like dick art. Like dick. <laughs> it's like dick art. It smells fucking delightful. Is everything just dicks? I don't know what. Stickers? Stranger dongs and stuff? Okay. They've made a business out of dicks. Smells fucking really good. What an interesting gift that was. Just, hey, we're getting, like, everything's a dick. Everything's a dick. 69 dicks, 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 dicks. Still pretty chill over here, save for the fact the post office uh, only accepting sexual payment. All right, aloha, Hawaii. Let's move along, corner of molding box. I definitely have the yips. It's hard to describe how much. Dave, if you don't uh, want this, give it to Trent. Iowa? I don't fucking wear an Iowa. I don't care about Iowa. I like Iowa. First fucking change of the day. I like that dong. I definitely, 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 definitely have the yips. I can't tell if this smells or not. It may. Here we go. A little Hawkeye action. Uh, two box cutters. What do we add on time here? 8.37. I feel like we went in slow, mo what is slow motion once I start getting bugs. Maple Sports Arena, Bro Hall, Pennsylvania. I don't think it is from Bauer, though. Skates? We're just getting rollerblades. Maple Sports Arena. Don't know who these guys are, but it must be like roller hockey because they sent some roller hockey blades. Not bad. That'll be a good giveaway. We are going to auction all this stuff off, give it away. We're going to figure out how to do it. It's not going to just go to waste. So don't worry about it. A lot of people asking. A lot of people want that Kobe painting from yesterday. We'll figure out. We'll make sure we get as much money for those who need it and all that shit. So don't worry about it. Travis Tomlin. See, I got to look now. I got to fucking look at everything because I'm getting fucking jet. King. Yeah. Uh, no, this is definitely a fake letter. Fake letter, fake letter, fake letter. Yeah, yeah, I gotta read now where shit's from. Because no offense, I don't wanna get a million fucking bugs. And I don't even like looking at this. I don't know what this is. Oh. What do we got here? Sneakers? Celtic sneakers, Beantown, 99. These are fucking huge. I don't know, really, I don't 
I think those are going to fit me in a basketball. Q4, big fans of the stool at Q4. Here are, uh, is a pair of player edition, unreleased, one-on-one -on -one sample shoes. You, you would look good in a bird jersey. No shit. Um, I don't think they sent you a bird jersey. Q4 sneakers. Okay. Stella Bean Portnoy, king of the toys, the greatest dog who ever lived. That's my quote from when I did a pizza review. Now we're getting back into the wholesome. It's just a painting of that, I assume. Hey, Dave, I live for the pizza reviews and now unboxing. Thank you for entertaining us during quarantine. I made you this paste, uh, painting in loving memory of the greatest dog who ever lived. Stella, may you rest in peace. Mackenzie Stith, for sure take me on a date next time you're in L.A. at Mackenzie Stith. That's awesome. I love that. Let me go put that somewhere. Great painting of Stella Bean. Bully sauce brand. There better be a letter because I don't. All right, there is. So we'll give it because I don't like sauce. I'm over the sauce game. Dave, big fans. Uh, we need to mix in some sauces with the frozen pizza. We make barbecue great again. Bully sauce. We have gotten a ton of sauces. It's been one of the number one things that we've gotten, to be honest. What? What is this? Don't hate pollinate. Is this gonna be bees or is this gonna be honey? Beekeeper Naturals. Okay, it's throat spread. We'll take that. That's how rattled I am right now. Zach McCauley Western. What the fuck? Head? Right. This is the second head we've gotten. Jesus Christ, what is it? Thanks for the internet gold. No plug, but never get. What the fuck? I mean, what the fuck? Fuck Jacks, wonderful pistachio, UPS death was. What is this? Jack's sister? Yikes. Yikes, yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. And then a knife. Some fucked up fucks out there, I'll tell you that much right now. Dave Portnoy, nothing, nothing else on it from Walmart. Is it from Walmart though, or is it gonna fucking jump out and bite me? No, we good. Looks like some fucking. Goldfish. I do like goldfish, but everyone knows I much prefer, and I get it, Randolph. Trust me, I get it. Oh, by the way, the Randolph merch on sale. It's fire, fire, fire. Uh, what do we got here? We're going to do it. We're, we're still doing it. Uh, what, what is I, I am so yippy. That was just cold and I got yippy. No, no nothing there on those. No sign, no nothing. Biddy Earls. Biddies. You want to see a guy get the yips tonight? You got it, boys. You got it. What are we at? We're at 18,009. Wow, for the first time ever, YouTube has the bigger audience than fucking... Instagram, we may have to switch this to YouTube uh, to YouTube permanently. YouTube twenty uh, is nineteen thousand, eighteen thousand. Go Prez Go from the most salt of the earth bar in Boston. We cut the sleeves off the T-shirt to show off the golden brown uh, cooks guns in Belichick. All right, Biddy Earls, Boston, Mass. I don't know what that is, but they they cut the fucking sleeves off so I could show guns. So I'll fucking do it. Oh, that's a quick way. You want me to get the guns out? It's like, hey, we know you got the fucking working on the dip pull-up machine in quarantine. Fuck right. 
There we go. Biddies. We'll take that. I've never heard of biddies. That shows how long I've been out of the city. All right. I don't like when I can't see underneath what's going on because then I get fucking nervous. It's just the fucking... I'm getting nervous over little fucking penguins now. I don't... Spiffy? So it just take control of your car? Oh, you just spit me like fucking... Spiffy it? That's what you do? All right. Fragile. Those fucking bugs. They're real deal bugs. They're just fucking huge. Slap your mama authentic Cajun produce? What? Slap your mama. I don't know what's going on here. T-shirts, sauce, low Cajun seasoning. A lot of, a lot of work. It's a big box. Authentic. Oh, yeah. What a hat. Mariachi band. Guantanamera. Juanita Guantanamera. Best song with mariachi band ever made, ever. Guantanamera. Juanita Guantanamera. Too small. Don't fit my head. Kind of look like a boss, but doesn't fit my head. Guantanamera, Juanita Guantana. You see how I did that, the feet thing? Very important. Fragile. To Jeff Bagwell. That's how they addressed it. Uh, how do I cover my address? I don't even know. It says to Jeff Bagwell. He ain't here, but it makes me think something could be happening here. Got to be on the lookout. Got to be on the lookout. Does it say insects or anything fucking weird on here? Like burnt dead people? Yeah, I got the yips. She's going to have to deal with it. I don't know what this is yet. Well told pint glasses. Okay. Sex toy. Fox is designed by Waze Group, famous adult production company. I don't know what this is. Feels like there's something in it. Maybe one of those flashlights that you stick your dick in. Got a bunch of those. Haven't used one yet. Been too tired. I will use a flashlight. I'll let you know how it goes. Golf 1922. Chris Tallahan. Orchard. Huge fans thought you could use a head cover for your new driver. I did get a new driver. Okay. A fucking nice head cover. Dave Porter. Yep. I'm on to you. One stop fish shop. Stop with it. But I'm on to you now. This doesn't even appear to be. Oh, this could just be a toy for a fish. I think this is just a toy. See, that's why you never know. This is just someone being nice, not a dick. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles for Randolph. Now that's nice. Now that's fucking nice. Some sort of weird hat, maybe? Oh, yeah. Was it like a Asian, like, Chinese hat? Like what they, in Singapore, where they ride around on the bikes? I think that's what we got here. Yeah, we're going from one country. This is like uh, the Amazing Race right now. Like we're all over the place. 
just taking a, a tour of culture. I don't mind that. You know what? In the summer, this will fucking keep you getting out. I like getting a glow. I like the sun. But if you don't, this fucking thing will keep it out of your face. Charles Blocks. Okay. No name on who this is from. It says Charles Blocks Men's Attire. Tamamuka Bagata or something Pennsylvania. Don't know what we got yet. Uh, the fuck? Masks. I'm the hey Prez, I'm the owner of Charles X Block. Uh, family owned operating men formal wear store around a hundred years. Due to weddings being canceled, we're losing thousands of dollars during this time. We've been able to make donate over two thousand masks. We also sent one of our suits because they love watching you, Tucker Carlson, based on your Google height. So they, they made me a suit, it looks like. If they think we'll fit. Charles Block. Let's see how I look in this fucking sport coat. I'm a 42 regular. Jackets fit me fucking perfect generally. Let's see how this does. Charles Block. A couple masks. Uh, I think maybe... The arm's a little bit small, but not the worst, not the worst. Tough to do it on site. Tough to just do it. Greetings from Alfred. Melrose Place Coffee. Sorry, let me make sure I didn't send stuff. This is a Death Wish production. Everyone knows that is Death Wish production. If you're sending coffee still, you're just not paying attention. Sorry, I'm sure it's great coffee. Death Wish coffee.com promo code Dave it's not here it is it's not fucking coke it's death wish I would don't time 851 a couple more and then we end the first session we're doing all right this won't be the longest session of all time Jack Cutter Justin Jeffries and it would be faster if people weren't sending me gag gifts that are making me slow down because I don't want to get fucking eaten. And if that makes me a pussy, then I'm a fucking pussy. You open fucking shit and have huge, ugly crawlers all over your fucking face. You do that. Jay, Jay Butler, let's get you some loafers. Ooh, I like these. Kind of have a, a Gucci vibe to them, right? That, isn't that like the knockoff Gucci thing, Jay Butler? I think it is. Some loafers. Always in the market with loafers. I like the bottom. These are nice leather. Jay Butler shoes. I bet those are a couple hundred bucks. Jay Butler. Jay Butler from Justin Jeffers. Oh, leather whip. Leather whip, I think it's the third one. I still haven't decided whether it's a weapon or a sex toy. I think it's more of a weapon. I think if you whip somebody with that guy, girl, gays, lesbians, like, you're hurting them pretty fucking bad. All right? This will be the last one of the first hour on Instagram. And then we take our Instagram break, come right back. Where we're at? We're at uh, 36, and, and YouTube's got 20, and Instagram's got 16 and a half. So 36,000, YouTube turning it to be the better platform. play music the thing is you get strikes like if you play any music you get fucking oh package in a package instant replay two day of best wishes lights out Lights out Lang, heavyweight, our heavyweight fucking champion of the world for Rough and Rowdy. This guy's the champ right there. Rough and Rowdy will come back.